What am I doing in this clinic? Oh, I dropped a bag of concrete on my foot and that was pretty sore. It's good. Alright, so I've got um, Jeff coming in. He's a 52 year old smoker. He likes to spend his nights at the pub. Probably the reason why he got a divorce. You know, spend the nights with those uh, pub chicks. Um, 183 centimetres, weighs about 95 kilos. I'd say he's about, I don't know, 28.84 BMI. Listen! Bring him in! Alright, um, how you been? Yeah, not bad, not bad. It's good. Alright, uh, we'll start by uh, maybe bringing up your diabetes and hypertension. How's that going? Yeah, I think it's going good right now. Mm. Have you cut down on the smoking? Yeah, I used to smoke like a pack a day now. Smoking around half a pack a day. That's good. So, uh, no, no serious problems with the diabetes that I'm going to look at today? No, I don't think so, no. I think it's going alright. Alright, and um, why are you here to see me today? Um, I dropped a bag of concrete on my foot and I think it's kind of swollen. Ah, but it's kind of warm. Let's just have a look at it. Hmm, I see. Just give me one second, yeah? Yeah, no, no, take your time, bro. Um, it's actually infected. It's looking pretty bad and um, I'm going to try to keep it calm. I think we're going to have to clean it out. Um, but he is pretty stressed out. We're going to use Tamazepam definitely. It will keep him calm throughout the procedure. So I'm going to get back in there. I'm just going to head down to the pharmacy now to grab some Tamazepam for our patient. So if you just follow me this way. Hey, how are you, mate? Hey, bro, how are you? Hey, I see a sign. Tamazepam on sale. Yeah, we've got Tamazepam on sale. It's gonna last for two weeks. Can I have a look at what you guys got? You can choose whatever you want. Oh, that's great. I'll have that one. Thanks, mate. And do you want some Tamazepam? Hey, I just wanted to let you know about the Tamazepam for a bit. Um, I'm just gonna tell you some information about it. All right. So you gonna give me some information about yeah, this? Yeah. Oh, just thanks, thanks. Just, thanks. just give me a sec. All right. I'm just gonna give you some information about tamazepam, about its pharmacokinetics. In this study in front of me, it says that it bounds to plasma protein at the rate of 96%, and it also has a short half-life of 0.4 to 0.6 hours, and a terminal half-life of 3.5 to 18.4. Else. After a half life of 10 hours, the metabolites were formed, and after a half life of around 2 hours, they were excreted. The mazepan is known to have an anxiolytic and hypnotic effect. These properties result in a musk and muscle relaxation and reduce the anxiety and the relaxation of the CNS, which is the central nervous system. The reason for these effects are thought to be association between the sites of the action of GABA and benzodiazepam. And finally, the potential of GABA may be responsible for these effects. Tamazepam is completely absorbed by a GI tract and thought completely by plasma protein bound. The peak plasma concentration is thought to occur after one hour after the dosing. That's it for pharmacodynamics. So how you feeling, Jeff? I think this drug is making me feel really calm. The Mazepad. So I'm just going to tape it up for you, and you'll be on your way. Awesome. Feels great. Feels great? Does it feel alright? Yeah, I reckon it feels really good. Thanks, bro. Put your shoes on, and thanks for coming in. And I'll see you for a review next week, yeah? Before the procedure, I gave Jeff Tamazepam to calm him down because he does have anxiety issues. Uh, it did work. 
he was very relaxed. He even uh, gave me feedback throughout the procedure saying that he was calm. This did have a positive effect and we'll definitely be using it on more patients like him in the future.